Breaking news from Starbase, Texas, where the next chapter in humanity's journey to the stars is taking shape. The aftermath of Starship's Flight 7 has left the space community buzzing with anticipation, as SpaceX engineers work tirelessly to implement game-changing modifications to their next prototype. In the scorching Texas heat, a new vision for Flight 8 is emerging. While the previous mission's ambitious plan to catch the ship mid-flight may have raised eyebrows across the aerospace industry, SpaceX isn't backing down. Instead, they're doubling down on innovation, with Elon Musk himself revealing a series of groundbreaking improvements that could revolutionize how we think about spacecraft design. The story of Flight 7 taught us valuable lessons. As the massive rocket ascended into the clear blue sky that day, few could have predicted the chain of events that would unfold. Fuel leaks, engine complications, and unexpected fires in the aft flap system ultimately led to an early mission termination. But in true SpaceX fashion, these challenges haven't dampened their spirit. They've only fueled their determination. Today, we're pulling back the curtain on the revolutionary changes being implemented for Flight 8. From enhanced fire suppression systems to redesigned venting mechanisms, every modification represents a step closer to achieving fully reusable spaceflight. These aren't just minor tweaks. They're fundamental improvements that could reshape the future of space exploration. As we walk through these exciting developments, we'll explore how SpaceX is addressing each challenge head on, transforming setbacks into stepping stones toward success. This is the story of innovation, perseverance, and the relentless pursuit of the stars. Welcome to Elon Musk 24 Hours, your premier source for SpaceX developments and breakthroughs. Let's dive right in. The sun beats down on the sprawling facilities at Starbase, where engineers gather around holographic displays and computer monitors, analyzing data from Flight 7's telemetry. The atmosphere is charged with determination, not disappointment. For SpaceX, each setback is a stepping stone toward revolution, and Flight 7's challenges have laid the groundwork for what could be their most significant breakthrough yet. Let's talk about the elephant in the room, the ship catching system. It's bold, innovative, and yes, some might say audacious, but that's exactly what defines SpaceX's approach to space exploration. While traditional aerospace companies might shy away from such ambitious plans, SpaceX sees it as the next logical step in achieving full reusability. The massive mechanical arms designed to pluck a returning starship from the sky represent more than just an engineering challenge. They symbolize humanity's growing confidence in mastering spaceflight. However, Flight 7 revealed critical issues that demand immediate attention. The most pressing concern emerged in the form of fuel leaks within the cavity above the ship's engine firewall. Picture this crucial space, a complex network of pipes, valves, and control systems, all working in perfect harmony to feed the mighty Raptor engines. When this harmony was disrupted by unexpected fuel leaks, it set off a chain reaction that would ultimately lead to the flight's early termination. Elon Musk's recent tweets have shed light on the specific nature of these problems. The combination of oxygen and fuel leaks created a perfect storm in that confined space. Think of it like a pressure cooker with a blocked vent. The pressure built up faster than the system could handle. This excess pressure didn't just pose a risk, it created conditions that led to fires, which then cascaded into engine failures one by one. But here's where the story takes an inspiring turn. SpaceX's response to these challenges showcases why they're at the forefront of space innovation. The engineering team isn't just patching holes, they're completely rethinking their approach to system safety. The first major upgrade involves the implementation of a sophisticated fire suppression system, a technological marvel that could change how we think about spacecraft safety systems. This new fire suppression system is anything but ordinary. Drawing inspiration from advanced aerospace technology, it incorporates multiple layers of protection. Highly sensitive sensors will monitor every critical area, ready to detect the slightest hint of trouble. When these sensors trigger, the system springs into action, deploying a combination of innovative solutions. One particularly clever approach involves utilizing the carbon dioxide byproducts from the engines themselves, turning what would typically be waste into a vital safety feature. But SpaceX isn't stopping there. The engineering team has identified another critical area for improvement, the venting system. 
Current designs have proved inadequate for the immense pressures generated during flight. The solution? A complete redesign that significantly increases the vent area, allowing for more efficient pressure management. This seemingly simple change required months of careful calculations and simulations to ensure it wouldn't compromise other critical systems. The Raptor 2 engines, while already pushing the boundaries of rocket propulsion technology, are also receiving crucial upgrades. Until the next generation Raptor 3 is ready for prime time, these powerhouses need additional protection. Engineers are reinforcing the heat shield system, paying particular attention to the vulnerable areas around the engine bay. Yes, this adds some weight to the vehicle, but as one senior engineer put it, sometimes you need to take one step back to take two steps forward. Perhaps one of the most visible changes comes in the form of the aft flap modifications. Unlike its forward counterpart, which has seen numerous iterations and improvements, the aft flap has remained relatively unchanged since the early designs. That's about to change. Taking lessons from the successful forward flap upgrades, engineers are implementing a more compact design that reduces stress on the crucial joint points while maintaining necessary control authority. The heat shield system, which showed promising performance during Flight 7's ascent phase, is also receiving attention. The improved adhesion of the thermal protection tiles marked a significant victory, finally solving the persistent problem of tile loss during launch. This success has given engineers the confidence to push further, implementing additional reinforcements around critical areas and introducing new metallic tiles in high-stress regions. But perhaps the most exciting developments are happening behind the scenes. Deep within the Starbase facility, engineers are working on a revolutionary payload and dispenser system. While not used in previous flights, this system represents SpaceX's commitment to commercial capabilities. Every component is being tested, retested, and refined to ensure flawless operation when the time comes to deploy actual payloads into orbit. The engine relight system, crucial for complex orbital maneuvers, is undergoing extensive modifications. Building on the successful space ignition during Flight 6, engineers are implementing redundant systems and improved fuel management protocols. These changes aren't just about making the system more reliable, they're about pushing the boundaries of what's possible within space propulsion. Currently, Ship 34 and Booster 15 stand in the production facility, embodying all these improvements and more. These aren't just iterations. They're the culmination of lessons learned through success and failure alike. The cryogenic tests have already shown promising results with improved structural integrity and better thermal management across all systems. The significance of these upgrades extends far beyond just fixing Flight 7's issues. Each modification, each improvement, each carefully considered change represents a step towards SpaceX's ultimate goal, making space travel as routine as air travel. The fire suppression system isn't just about preventing fires. It's about building confidence in spacecraft safety. The improved venting system isn't just about managing pressure. It's about creating more robust and reliable spacecraft architecture. As we look toward Flight 8, these improvements paint a picture of a spacecraft that's not just more capable, but more resilient. The reinforced heat shield, the optimized flap systems, the enhanced engine protection, all these elements work together to create a vehicle that's pushing the boundaries of what's possible in spaceflight. Looking at the bigger picture, these developments at SpaceX are sending ripples through the entire aerospace industry. Traditional aerospace companies are watching closely, and some are already beginning to adopt similar innovative approaches to spacecraft design and development. This isn't just about SpaceX anymore. It's about advancing the entire field of space exploration. The road ahead isn't without its challenges. Each new system, each modification, brings its own set of complexities that must be carefully managed. But if there's one thing that sets SpaceX apart, it's their ability to turn challenges into opportunities for innovation. The improvements being implemented for Flight 8 aren't just fixes, they're evolutionary steps in spacecraft design that will influence space travel for decades to come. As the sun sets over Starbase, the work continues. Engineers review simulations, technicians fine-tune systems, and the next generation of Starship takes shape. Every weld, every sensor installation, every line of code brings us closer to a future 
where the stars are within reach. Flight 8 isn't just another test flight, it's a testament to human ingenuity, perseverance, and the unwavering pursuit of our cosmic destiny. As we stand on the brink of Flight 8, each modification, each improvement represents another step toward making life multiplanetary. The story of Starship isn't just about technical achievements, it's about humanity's unwavering spirit to push boundaries and reach for the stars. From the enhanced fire suppression systems to the redesigned venting mechanisms, SpaceX is writing the next chapter in space exploration. These aren't just fixes, they're evolutionary steps that will shape the future of spaceflight. With each test, each iteration, we move closer to a future where Mars isn't just a distant dream, but a tangible destination. Stay connected with Elon Musk 24 hours for the latest updates on these groundbreaking developments. Your support fuels our mission to bring you the most comprehensive coverage of SpaceX's journey to revolutionize space travel. Hit that subscribe button to join our growing community of space enthusiasts. Drop your thoughts in the comments below about which upgrade you think will have the biggest impact and share this video with fellow space enthusiasts who share our passion for innovation. Remember, every great achievement in human history started with a single step, and together we're witnessing the steps that will take humanity to the stars. This is Elon Musk 24 Hours, where we turn space dreams into reality. Until next time. In the high-stakes world of space exploration, even the smallest engine hiccup can mean the difference between success and failure. That's exactly what SpaceX discovered during their latest Starship launch, when their cutting-edge Raptor engine threw them an unexpected curveball. As the world's most powerful rocket soared through the atmosphere, everything seemed perfect, until it wasn't. The Raptor engine, SpaceX's crown jewel that generates power equivalent to four Hoover dams, has been pushing the boundaries of rocket science. But with great power comes great complexity. During the recent launch, after flawlessly executing the initial ascent and stage separation, one of Super Heavy's engines decided to play hard to get, refusing to reignite during the crucial deceleration burn. Then, in a twist that left engineers scratching their heads, the same engine fired up perfectly minutes later, as if nothing had ever happened. But the story doesn't end there. On Starship itself, another Raptor engine suddenly shut down, leading to a dramatic turn of events that would test SpaceX's engineering prowess to its limits. What caused these mysterious engine behaviors? What does this mean for the future of Mars exploration? And how is SpaceX tackling these challenges head on? Hey everyone, welcome to Elon Musk 24 Hours, where we break down the latest developments in space technology. Let's dive right in. E the mystery of the Raptor engine's behavior during SpaceX's latest launch raises a fascinating question. How do you tame an engine that's powerful enough to take humans to Mars? The answer lies in understanding one of the most complex pieces of machinery ever created. When the engine failed to reignite during Super Heavy's deceleration burn, SpaceX engineers faced a scenario they'd seen before, but with a twist. Minutes later, like a temperamental sports car suddenly roaring to life, the engine started perfectly. This wasn't just an engineering anomaly. It was a glimpse into the profound challenges of pushing rocket technology to its absolute limits. The root of these issues runs deeper than just a simple malfunction. Inside every Raptor engine, a carefully orchestrated dance of extreme forces takes place. Picture temperatures hot enough to melt the engine walls. We're talking about heat that would vaporize most metals instantly. The only thing preventing this destruction is an ingenious cooling system that would make your car's radiator look like a child's toy. But the real drama unfolded on Starship itself. During the critical phase of flight, one of the Raptor engines unexpectedly shut down. According to Elon Musk, the culprit was a leak in the cavity above the engine firewall, a seemingly small issue that cascaded into a major problem. In the vacuum of space where there's no atmospheric pressure to help regulate things, this leak created a pressure buildup that the engine's vent system simply couldn't handle. Think about trying to control a fire hose with a pinch line. Now multiply that pressure by a thousand. That's what the Raptor engine was dealing with. 
The precise ballet of fuel and oxidizer injection, crucial for the engine's operation, became impossible under these conditions. It's like trying to pour a precise measurement of water through a fire hose. You just can't maintain that level of control. The challenge doesn't end with just making the engine work. It needs to work repeatedly. SpaceX achieved a significant milestone by reusing an engine from Flight 5, and it performed flawlessly. This success opens up new possibilities for the future of space travel, but it also raises the stakes. Each reuse provides valuable data, but it also introduces new variables into an already complex equation. The Raptor engine's power is almost beyond comprehension. 11 million horsepower from something weighing just a ton and a half. To put that in perspective, that's like fitting the power of four Hoover dams into something the size of your car's engine. This incredible power comes at a price. The engineering challenges multiply exponentially with each increase in performance.